Hello and welcome to another edition, the last edition of the whole damn thing, Fallout New Vegas' Old World Blues. I'm J.P. Arbiter. I'm Mrs. Arbiter. And we begin, or we end, much as we began, with talking. An obtuse amount of talking. Look at that ass. Look at that ass sway. Hip, baby, hip. Hip, hip baby, hip. hip. Womp, there it is. They all have different colors. I never noticed that before. The lobotomite Might returns. returns. Oh, Our lobotomite. Is Dr. Moby has been... Denominated into scrap metal and Denominatored. Parts, as we hoped. I f <laughs> Um, not exactly. I recommend watching your tone with me, Lobotomite. Now, your brain. Hand it over, or we'll extract it again. No. And Just what could we no. We have to speak about. You have the brain. We have the technology. All you must do is surrender. With it, we can finally leave <laughs> this place. I cannot tell you how boring this place gets, chopping up the landscape and everything in it. <laughs> and we have so many questions to ask your brain first about this Mojave place, a fertile testing ground for our experiments. Nope. <laughs> oh! Nonsense! Confer? Confer? Colleagues? colleagues? Those are two words I do <laughs> These are my guys. minions! Dr. Klein, I must intersect. Please, do not harm the <laughs> might. I'm not going to harm it. I'm going to dissect it until it's dead. Um. By the sudden intersection. Don't I have a say in that? I cannot stand a I'm I'm suddenly not part of this conversation, but I feel like I should be a part of it. And out to suddenly <laughs> not breathe. We must keep it alive. For study. Slow, Slow study. study. Gala, these vocalized pauses are unlike you. What do you care? Captain oh Kirk God. syndrome. You know, this lobotomite is a great sounding board. You respect ideology, right? This one's... Indeed. Well, it's got like Captain Kirk. Silence, <laughs> Dr. O. Dr. O! Decision. Save your objections until after I after decide, I decide a course of action. Of action. You know so, what, you're saying I'm... shut up. Stick a straw in your tank and suck yourself. Ah! Long and deep. Long and deep. Zero. Yeah, a big, a big fat zero, zero with, with a slash through it. through it. The slash as a designator of... Why, that is brilliant. But how did you... The lobotomite taught me that. Taught me a name is more than... Um, that I should take pride in... Things. things. Like, like names and, and puppies. You Puppies. Forget it, Klein. I hate you. And your theory of Bringle Beam oscillation? The Chinese have <laughs> you, copycat. <laughs> dare you? Bringle Beam oscillation was solely my discovery. I expressed. Oh, it was me. It was all me. It was all me. It was all me. I told you that, and I made sure that all evidence is otherwise was. <laughs> it's two, eight. Wait, what? Why are you acting like this? You've never refused to commit necessary sur surgery before. And this lobotomite needs its surgery. Yes, cut me open, baby. Yeah. Bring it. Really? I will rip your brain right out of its jar and toss it away laughing. All you have to do is punch it. Really? Yeah. And I've got a special glove to punch with a now. Noble speech, but there is punchy, no punchy. vocabulators for friend, friend and, and lobotomite in the same, same sentence. sentence. The very concept, <laughs> revolting. 
Perhaps you are irradiated with camaraderie radiation. We Is that a thing? That. No. I mean, gamma waves are angry radiation if the Avengers taught me anything. If I may, I well, gamma rays are a thing. Must be the voice of reason here. This lobotomite is much like us. Regarding even animals and pets is nothing more than avenues to promote science. Science. Good here. And you're a complete and total. We should prolong well, I'd say dork, but that wouldn't quite be a appropriate word. He wants to prolong my suffering in the name of science. Uh, thanks, I guess. Thanks, Frankenstein. Good lord. Frankenstein? If a word I hate, it's mutiny. And the word jism, which never made any sense. Just putting j and zm together like that. They're just... Five. Like the mighty human hand I once had with its five, That's five penises, penises right clenched in a fist. You don't know much about your anatomy, do you? Nonsense! The mathematics of this situation are on our side, Lobotomite! I believe... No, wait. Hmm. Carry the two. Carry the two. Hmm. If this were a democracy, I would be concerned. We are too scientific for that. For that. So just, so surrender. just surrender. <laughs> and over half your colleagues dispute your findings. Aha! You I outsmarted you with me. science! Yes, you do. You... Of course you use logic against him. That's just the fun part of it. Wow, that's like something my mother said to me once. Meh? How dare you use logic against me? Here's the deal. I'm not gonna surrender. You are. That's no deal at all. There's a whole world beyond the crater filled with ideas and possibilities. We could have Stuff, things, ideas, science, industry, men with screwdrivers. We can squirm. <laughs> we can probe it and get squirm. Men with screwdrivers. Turning things and adjusting them. <laughs> you can still do that here, quietly, from me. For you, and for science. Science. A strange sensation that I would like that. How odd. Very well, partner. The think tank is at your service as long as you do not destroy us. Can I just destroy Klein? If only. I mean, seriously? Because Klein's a douche. Yeah. And I want to be rid of him. So. The rest are cool. He's not. Yep. So that was Old World Blues. Mrs. Arbiter, what do you think? It's neat. It's a hoot. Oh, it's funny as hell. Honestly, some of the best the writing <clears throat> I have ever seen uh, in any video game. Safe until they and, and, to and the thing that made it makes it so great is that it revels in the ridiculousness. And reveling in the ridiculousness is part of what can make Fallout so good. You know, it's right up there with Liberty Prime spouting anti-communist propaganda while blowing shit up. I swear to God, the sink sounds like Paul Bettany, even though I know it's not. So. Internally, the artificial personality debated as to whether it preferred the old the old management to the new, and concluded that the courier's thorough approach to research and investigation was admirable and worthy of its respect. Yes, Doctor Mobius continued his research undisturbed in the Forbidden Zone. <laughs> as much as I'm reminded of there was this movie that was supposed to be about Beethoven, where apparently he would write music on the slats. Uh huh. And his excuse was, well, when I'm done and I transcribe into paper, people sell them and make a lot of money off of it. So, you know, that's why I keep doing it. <laughs> After all, a bright young mind who had come to visit him in the Forbidden Zone had already exceeded his expectations. I'm good at that. The sink atop the dome bustled with the voices of a small town, 
constantly chirping, arguing, and snarling at each other. <laughs> Still, this all happened productively in the interests of its new owner. Yay! The Central Intelligence Unit discovered, despite its inversion code, it was comforted by the sense of community the other personalities gave it. The biological research station, obsessed with seeding everything in sight, requested oh, yeah. transfer to the X-22 Botanical Garden. So that it might, in its own words, sensually fertilize the garden's smooth contours. Why do I have a boner from that? <laughs> the garden sent back a polite refusal, saying it had prior commitments with a vault it had helped infect before the war. <laughs> the book shoot continued to devour all seditious materials. Oh, it must be happy as can be. On a paperclip. It adamantly Those damn paper it clips. Was a Chinese paper clip. And the whole thing had been an elaborately orchestrated assassination attempt. Damn One dirty Chinese paper clips. Slowed down for a while, carefully appraising each document and clipboard that came to it. The light switches continued to bicker and flicker. This persisted until the day someone dropped a flashlight in the sink, and the two of them united in their hatred of the showboat. <laughs> One of them eventually transferred to the Lightwave Dynamics plant and began a long, unrequited affair with one of the holograms. Oh, that's so sad. The sink continued to ruthlessly scrub any particulate matter that came near it. Eventually, it gained access to the magnetohydraulics plant and nearly flooded all the big empty in an attempt to scrub the crater clean. Well, that would be Once thorough. It yeah. The innovative toxins plant, however, it gained, it gained new, purpose. new purpose. It sought to develop antitoxins to flush into so, the So, I mean, drains, innovative toxins. <laughs> we must develop new and innovative ways to kill people. Continued its psychotic spree. Reducing all appliances in range to scrap electronics. Hail the toaster. Peace of Blake After be with you. More psychotic episodes, however, the other sink personalities decided enough was enough hey, and dumped the toaster in a bathtub. <laughs> Psycho -toaster. Sparking and hissing, the toaster swore its enemies would rue the day. Rue the they day had they had bread. And no way to and toast, no it. Way to toast it. Did his best to collect coffee cups. Aww. Although coffee cups. The <laughs> and <laughs> Muggy is the real hero of Fallout New Vegas. It might have been the end. <laughs> Except he found it peaceful there, tidying up the kitchens of the thing. I mean, just <laughs> he's so cute and adorable and psychotic. Well, except for Doctor O, who was an asshole, asshole for having created <laughs> Muggy in the first place. Muggy left O's house deliberately dirty, punishing the dishes and cups that live there in blind revenge for certain. <laughs> Doctor O. You show those dishes. Jefferson, the sound of the warrior brought him and created a symphonic counter frequency that saved Big Mountain from sonic invasion in 2910. Wow. If you didn't hear about it. Good. Good. What would a sonic invasion be? Personalities that he had a <laughs> with the light switches. Oh, baby. Although he forgot their names once too often and was soon left in the dark as punishment. Is that like don't fuck Auto with the people who prep your food? Always gentle and methodical. Pretty much. Kept sewing up the courier in all the right places when the skin split open from repeated wear and tear. <laughs> the auto doc was just oh, I just realized that the auto doc has "Get Well Soon" written in the bottom. Simpler brothers and sisters who got shipped to the Sierra Madre were bored out of their skulls in that toxic dead city. <laughs> in time, the auto doc found a way to deactivate the Y17 trauma harnesses, releasing the corpses they had held prisoner for almost 200 years. Aww. As the courier ran through the X8 facility multiple times. <laughs> Dr. Principal Boros! Movements. <laughs> Rather than performing a superficial observation, they realized the subject barely knew what communism was. Or, or even what a high school was. This confused them for a time, until the facility finally realized that its research had succeeded. 
Science! So it let its cyber dogs out into the wastes to help protect small communities from physical aggression rather than, rather than communist propaganda. propaganda. The infiltration program in X-13 felt spent, having repeatedly upgraded the stealth suit until it could upgrade it no more. It felt Aww. fulfilled and a bit sluggish. It realized not long after the stealth suit had left it without so much as a note on the nightstand. Aww. So the Aww. infiltration program sent out robo-brains into the wastes, looking for its wayward technology. It eventually Aww. found Repcon HQ and set up a new research center, testing and murdering fiends. <laughs> Kept breaking into the facility. <laughs> the courier, nice. organs intact, continued onwards, a little less heavy of step, but with all the organs in the right places. Right places as, as, they, they, should, should as they should be. After all, brains can develop a life of their own when left to their own thoughts. And the courier's brain was more clever than most. <laughs> Dr. Klein and the think tank remained alive, unaware of the world outside. They looped through their daily routine, none the wiser about the world beyond. <laughs> Although perhaps... The wiser was the wrong the word. word. Yeah. I think, uh, side belong to the current. What is it? Excellence and, and ignorance is probably the best way to describe it. Yes. Had already called dibs. There is an expression <laughs> in the wasteland Old, Old World, world blues. blues. It refers to those You think the sole survivor out in the Commonwealth suffers from Old World Blues the hardest? Probably. For what it is. <laughs> they stare into the what was, eyes like pilot lights. Guttering and spent, as the realities of their world continue on around them. Science is a long, steady progression into the future. What may seem a sudden event often isn't felt for years, even centuries to come. In the times following the second battle of Hoover Dam, <laughs> however, old world old blues, blues took on a new took meaning. A new meaning. <laughs> Where once it was viewed as a form of sadness. Nostalgia. It became an expression describing the potential for the future. It can be easy to see science as evil. Technology unchecked as the source of all ills. Certain uh, Americans need to see that. With the courier yeah. at the helm, science became a beacon for the future. There was old world blues. And new world hope. And hope ruled the day at Big Mountain. Yay, hope! But the stories in the big empty speak for themselves. <laughs> now armed with the transportal ponder, the courier could return to the day. Transportal and ponder. Open the secrets of the big empty one by one. The sink sat vigilant, waiting for its master to return. Shoes covered in Mojave dust. Only one road yet remained, and it was one the courier had to walk alone. Ah. Well, you know, actually no, because this is the first DLC of Fallout New Vegas that I do, like, every time. Yeah. So, you know. That's it in a bag of chips? That is it in a bag of chips. Should we return for, uh, uh, dead money? I think so. Think so? All right. Well, with that, uh, we will be, uh, taking a break, and, uh, yeah. We'll return at a uh, later time and date for Dead Money uh, in Fallout New, New Vegas. So with that, we'll be seeing you.